Hey guys, welcome back to part three, four, anyway, welcome back to this installment of how to build, um, basically stream on a budget, game on a budget, um, you name it, basically just cheap PC building, um, I know some people, some of my followers are on unemployment or SSI, welfare, PIP, you name it. Um, and so finances are high. And so what I'm going to be doing today is showing you how can we upgrade our original PC, which we bought for 160 pounds um, on, on Amazon. And uh, how would you go about um, making it last, uh, making your little war machine keep going and lasting and, and taking something that's an older case, an older... Uh, 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 CPU motherboard and RAM, and and keeping them keeping them going so that you can play your favorite video games. Um, not necessarily AAA titles like uh, you know things of that nature, but games that you play and enjoy. Well, we've upgraded the graphics card by now. We've upgraded the RAM by now, and now we'll, and we've even upgraded the power supply. Now, when you do upgrade the power supply. You're going to need a an adapter, and I'm going to show it to you. Where's the D not right? There it is. This is what you need. You knew what I needed. Sorry about that. This is what you need. You need a 24 pin to 8 pin adapter for the Dell Optimix series. You can buy these. I, I I've bought bought one, as I showed you in the previous video. You can buy these, they do work. Right, let me just turn on my overhead light. There we go. You can buy them, they do work. Um, and basically what they do is they take a 24 pin power supply and turn it into an eight pin power supply for the Dell motherboard. So you can now officially take that Dell motherboard out of the Dell case and even get a bigger upgraded graphics card um, later on down the line. This is what I like to call future proofing. So you'd want to get one, buy one of these, okay, and then wait until you buy your upgraded power supply. Now that upgraded power supply is not going to fit the Dell case, so this is why we look over at Facebook and we look at cheap PC cases, um, like right here, fifty pounds, forty pounds, forty pounds. There you go. This little Corsair Titanium is perfect. This would be a perfect little upgrade for you. But everything you've got planned. Okay? And I mean that. It would be perfect. And. Heck I might even snag this. Um, but this would be a perfect little case. You've got your front USBs and stuff and whatnot That you will be able to use. Because again. Um, some ports on the Dell motherboard is standardized. Some ports are not. The, some of the things you cannot do. And in fact, I even have the computer. But it. I've been moving some stuff around. And so, because I've been moving things around, I have lost track of a few items. One second, guys. Here it actually is. As you can see, this is. This is the Dell computer. This item here, okay, is the front USB uh, LED instrument cluster panel and whatnot that you cannot remove. If you remove this from the motherboard, the motherboard will have booting issues. Okay, so this has to stay with the motherboard. Uh, I don't think there's an adapter out there for it to like get rid of it. Um, I'll, I'll keep an eye out for one, and if I do find one, I'll post a link in the video. I'll post a link in, in uh, the comment section. But as you can see, this is a Dell Optimix motherboard. Um, I have, like I said, I have been recently um, upgrading various other parts of other computers, and this is actually just sitting around gathering dust now. Um, so I know this upgrade path works. Okay, because I physically have the proof to show you. This does work. Okay, so the upgrade path does work. 
so there you go it um so you can put it in a different case as you can see you've just seen me put it in a computer case so yes you can put it in a different case once you've put it in a different case okay and you've got a better power supply and everything else i would then look at upgrading graphics cards now you can get them a lot when when when, when people say graphics cards they immediately think, oh, it's going to cost me hundreds of thousands of dollars. It's not. I showed you earlier. We've already technically got a little low-profile graphics card in there for £35. You can put a better graphics card in there. Now, if you're not hurting for time and you can wait, you can go to places like Alibaba. Okay. I have an Alibaba account because I buy mining cards. Um... Let me just log in real quick. I oh, I'll sort that. But um, I am in the process of buying some fairly cheap graphics cards. Now this is a a, a good little eight gig card. For the price you can't knock it um so for under 100 pounds you can get yourself an 8 gigabyte rx 580 yes it's already on doesn't matter the reason why it doesn't matter is because it's good enough to play some decent games at decent frame rates um and it's not necessarily a power hog like most people assume it is um but yes this is technically alibaba so technically you you might not get what you pay for you might do I only buy from verified, uh, uh, see verified suppliers, verified uh, 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 manufacturers. That means you're guarant. It, it, it's it's a more reliable guarantee that Alibaba is going to back you up if the product you get isn't what you what you, what you purchased. But um, yeah, see, trade insurance protects you from Alibaba orders. Do you see what I'm saying? So you will. It, it's not necessarily just throw money into the wind. Again, this is this is designed to help you guys upgrade your rigs as cheap and as efficient as possible. Now, I buy these cards for my my GPU mining rigs. Uh, yes, I do crypto mining. Uh, sue me. Don't really. Please don't. Please don't. But point is, I do I do other things to to source my income coming in. Um, but yeah, you can easily buy. And if you want, you can get the graphics card I've got, which is the sixteen sixty. This isn't my sixteen sixty. Um, but it's 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 the equivalent to it. Um, so yeah, you can buy a sixteen sixty, put it in, and it will play games like Escape from Tarkov, War Thunder. Um, you know, it will play quite uh, quite a few games at some really decent frame rates. Okay, and so yeah, don't don't be afraid, guys. You know, I mean, yeah, the price difference is night and day, but you know. These cards are meant to be gamed on or mined on. They last you about two years and then replace them. You know, throw it up on on Facebook or wherever for half of what you paid for it, and you'll make you'll get something back at least. So anyway, um, so that's the cases. That's the graphics card that uh, we talked about. Power supplies in the previous video. Um, we've talked about microphones, we've talked about webcams, we've talked about headsets, we've talked about pretty much everything else that you need. We've even talked about display panels. You can pick up monitors used on Facebook Marketplace, on eBay, uh, even brand new for, uh, for, for cheap on Amazon. Here, let's take a look at uh, yeah, 24 inch displays. Okay, £100 right there. Again, your prices may differ depending on the country that you're in, but that's a good little monitor to start gaming on and playing on. And, and, and heck, get for that price, I would, if I had the finances, of course, again, if you have the finances, of course, buy two of them, set one up to be the main display for your gaming, and set the other one up so you can read chat, various other things if you're on Twitch or YouTube, or if you're just a content creator, just, you know, use it to help edit your videos your content things of that nature and go from there guys you can do this you can you, you can absolutely do this okay this doesn't cost you an arm and a leg 
So roughly we're about, we're under, we should be under 800 pounds total all in with a, with a complete fully upgraded rig. Um, so you've got a really good processor, 32 gigs of RAM, uh, a six to eight gig graphics card now, custom power, you know, power supply that can power it all, monitor, mouse, keyboard, graphics card, uh, uh, um, webcam, headset, microphone. You are literally all set to just go out there, be the content king or queen you can be. Hey guys, so yeah, uh, if you guys have any more questions or comments or concerns, uh, please leave a comment in the video description down below. I'll do my best to watch them. Till then, guys, peace and love, love and respect. Keep sure to find who's dying. Cobra Commander is out. See you guys in the next video.